creating multiple copies of an element we're going to uh, go to modify we're going to select on this chair and now that we have this chair selected we're going to go up to the modify panel and select on copy and when we have the copy command is in effect up here in our options bar we have multiple and I can I'm going to take constrain uh, I'm going to leave constraint on for now and I'm going to choose multiple and it'll ask me now to click to enter move start point so I'm going to pick right on the corner of the chair and I'll pick now I'm going to drag my chair over and I'm going to place it right here right in front of the window here and I'm going to put another one in and I'll place it right in front of this window and I'll hit escape twice and now I got two chairs in front of the window. Um, I can see that I might want to move this over a, a smidge in here, so I'm just going to grab it and hold it down, and I'm going to move that over a little bit. Okay. And uh, so the move command is really underneath the copy command. So we want to go and choose modify, select the object, make sure we say copy and we want to make sure the multiple is checked. When the multiple is checked, I can get rid of constrain. Now I can grab a hold of it by a, a point, say the end point, and I can move it over here and I can place, say, a chair here and I can place, you know, a chair there, etc. Um, so uh, I can move these things around anywhere I want, uh, however I like them and that's how we create multiple copies of an element.